Despite some changes under the hood, the latest ARC strives to deliver the same luxury and comfort it always has. The 2023 Lexus Rezus has been fully redesigned, but despite some changes to the underhood ingredients, it aims to bring drivers the same sense of luxury and comfort that defined its predecessors. The new SUV is available as a gas-powered ARX 350, an ARX 350H hybrid, and a higher-performing ARX 500H hybrid. There's also a plug-in hybrid ARX for 50H Plus that will join the lineup later. The most noticeable change in the SUV styling is to the spindle grille. This design element has always been polarizing, and the new one likely will be too, particularly, the bulging transition from the more upright trapezoidal lower section of the grille to the hood throws us off. The wheelbase is 2.4 inches longer, and the rear overhang is shorter. The previously available three-row L version jets the sack. It's like a little be replaced by a new model called the TX. The entry level are X350 swaps last year's V6 for a turbocharged 2.4-liter inline-4. Mated to an 8-speed automatic, it makes 275 horsepower and 317 pound-feet of torque. That's 20 fewer horses than last year, but an increase of 50 pound-feet. We expect the front wheel drive our X350 will reach 60 miles per hour in 7.2 seconds, while the all-wheel drive version should take 6.9 seconds. The last our X350 F Sport we tested record 6.7 seconds, which is rather slow for the class. The ARX 350H is the responsible and efficient pick. Its hybrid powertrain now features a non-turbo Atkinson Cycle 2.5 liter 4 and fuel economy is estimated at 36 mpg combined. A continuously variable transmission with two electric motors turns the front wheels, while a third electric motor drives the rears. Combined output comes to 246 horses and 233 pound-feet, which should get the ARX 350H to 60 miles per hour in 7.8 seconds. The ARX 500H represents a high-performance hybrid counterpoint, with the turbo 4 engine from the RX 350 and a more potent rear electric motor that combine for 366 horsepower and 406 pound-feet. We expect it'll reach 60 miles per hour in 5.6 seconds. None of these ARX models, though, are particularly sporty or fun to drive. Instead, Lexus puts comfort and luxury ahead of performance, the same strategy that has served the ARX well for decades. The ARX 350H feels unusually anemic, however, requiring you to floor the accelerator to match the flow of highway traffic. Meanwhile, the engine groans loudly as it labors and makes the ARX 350H feel slower than it is. With a sizable jump in power and a conventional six-speed automatic, the ARX 500H doesn't suffer as badly. It's quicker to respond and breaks up the drone with traditional shifts. It instills much more confidence, but is still no rocket, as it would get smoked by a BMW X5 X5 40i, which reaches 60 miles per hour in only 4.8 seconds. Handling performance doesn't fare any better. The soft suspension tuning doesn't encourage spirited driving, and undulations in the road tend to produce residual rebounds after the event. The brake pedal further degrades confidence with its mushy feel and long stroke. Typically, it is driver assist features, more than performance, that woo the Lexus shopper, and here the ARX is adequate. The adaptive cruise control smoothly maintains a gap between cars and we never experienced false alarms from the forward collision warning. We did get numerous irritating false alarms from the driver attention monitor, though, and the lane keeping assist isn't as advanced as rivals, and tends to wander from edge to edge of a lane with drunken indecision. But we suppose that is why it has assist in its name. The Arx's interior is most improved, especially with regard to infotainment. Lexus ditches the outgoing SUV's much maligned trace pad controller and instead switches to a touchscreen setup. A 9.8-inch unit is standard, though a 1-4.0-inch display is optional. The dashboard is more modern and striking than before, but some cabin materials, such as the plastic on the center console and the lighter-colored fake wood grain, left us disappointed. By contrast, the mix of more substantial elements on the dash and the fabric door inserts are up to luxury standards. 
Redesigned, but not reimagined, the 2023 ARC should meet the expectations of returning Lexus customers who value calm comfort over potent performance. Those more accustomed to pricier German luxury SUVs, however, will likely find the ARCs wanting in terms of driving dynamics and interior quality. Lexus, though, seems wary of majorly altering its original and popular formula, 